You should be hosting a World Cup watch party. That's right. Head on over to oldworldcup.com. Not the Apex Legend links to Gifty. Goblin links to too much. And most importantly, of course, burn drops for your streams. You don't want to miss out on all the action. And wow, they're actually promoting the this or if you're just cool by yourself, face. Enjoying That's a such a big and, change uh, from old Blizzard. They're sure actually promoting to, uh, watch parties now. Using the Damn, dude. WWC. Like, I don't think you guys understand how much how much has changed in the last year. You know? Yeah, we all complain about things and we complain about, like, always wanting things better. But like we fought hard for shit for like four years, and they're kind of leaning into it now, and it, it kind of shows that uh, you know maybe we maybe we made some changes, some good changes. We fought for some good changes, and I think long term that's some of the best stuff they could do. It is weird that they're promoting it, but it's a good weird. They should be doing that. That's something they should do if they actually wanted to get the esports come back to life. That is absolutely the way they should do it, because for those don't know and haven't been a part of the overwatch history for a long 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 year long time nobody gives a shit because the longest time overwatch like forced out every streamer they didn't want to they didn't want to work with anybody they only wanted to work with it when they were dying at the last second so now that overwatch league's kind of gotten sent off to the farm if they want to bring something new back kind of the way they do it you know jakaru oh man i like both these teams i like jakaru but i also like seeker crimson oh man in comparison to GBR. Echo oh, yeah, Sojourn versus like Echo Tracer. With that advantage, First Seeker also for Backbone, who was caught out in the cage side. So True. Already kind of opting for a soft reset. Right now, just backing up, waiting prime. for their end to respawn. Um, but that's going to give the first point to Canada. Thanks, thanks, thanks this is the super so chat. I appreciate it. I love this. Normally, when you have a D.Va, the Echo gets such a huge leg up. They're in the same room plots. On the Alari, Which one is it? They are or they aren't? I actually get close enough to be able to use the figure out later. to melt through the defense matrix. And as a result, they have to give all of the space up to Canada. No, it's not. Seeker, still sitting on the right side. Throwing those grenades towards Backbone. Also, a nade comes through from Crimson. Connects on the Mimo, gets him out of one. I like uh, Canada's comp a little bit better. Takaru goes all in, gets the kill, but I don't know if that's worth trade. All space, we can just play anti tank and just chase him around. And they can't really push out either. Kai is just deadly on the Sojourn. Kai is. Realistically, like the centerpiece of Great Britain. Like, as long as you keep Kai up, every fight's winnable. See, they focus them, they all in for Kai. That's they're going to be their plan. They're going to all in for Jakaru if he goes early. And then if they don't all in Jakaru, they're going to all in Kai every fight. That is literally their plan. It's such a fast flip as well. Also, it's I don't really like the break comp so that they're running. I don't see why they're running break. Style of play to make sure that Canada is not playing dive. Like, yeah, they have the tracer, I guess, tracer diva, but they're really not going for the backline at all. I feel like I would play, or I, I would think that the Ilari Ana comp or Ilari Bath, well, no, not Bath, Ilari Ana would be better. If Backbone actually gets to use it, he's continued to be backed by Seeker. Yeah, to use it on Jakaru, who already used the jump. However, Maimon's able to find that first kill. Has and Jakaru doesn't get much done with it. They're able to find two. Seeker, though, does trade back one. Backbone out of the fight. So that is going to be a lot of the heals for Yeah, should shut the bed there. Great Britain. Kai, meanwhile, able to find Seeker on the point. So Great Britain just kind of walking their way through here. And he's a lot old, so. 76%, maybe 77% for Canada. Actually, Hard no, they didn't. Flip. It was they Canada that used so two ults. Oh, I thought. Wait, they only used Nano. That's actually pretty good. Never mind. Ultimate, and they don't have the D.Va. The only thing that's going to be able to block that ultimate is going to be Jakaru's bubble. Yeah, if they get a big Ilari ult on the back line, Canada. this is going to be tough. Setting up on their engagement. If I was betting, man, I bet they're going to go for Kai with the ult. Did he miss? Wait, he missed. He, they, did I watch it explode on the ground next to Kai? In the sky wall. I think he missed. Coffee, just building up towards that nano charge, also keeping Jakaru alive on the inside, making sure he doesn't have to use the primal rage while well, he's backing up. Or wow, I got another nano. Canada. Holy he's shit, back while farming. The and lands on a Dude, let's go, Jakaru. I don't even know who I want to win this one. I like both these teams. They opted the reset here. Looks like they do. I actually, uh, objective. I, you know what? I honestly, I don't. I, I'm not rooting for anybody in this fight. I don't care or this game. I like people on both of these teams. 
take away that space and not let Falls build the space for his DPS to begin to pop off. Uh, Canada thinks it's 2 1. Sochi thinks it's 2 1. Baron thinks it's 4 months. Bill thinks it's 2 months. Bio. Slain Steven thinks it's 3 months. Yeah, this overclock is going to be huge for Great Britain. And this is basically the last fight. He's just going to turn and burn. Yeah. Jakaru, but he's got the primal rage. Keep Ooh, what primal rage though? Look at his health bar, it's just disappearing. Wait, he gets one though! Holy shit. Damn, Jakaru go crazy! Damn! Showing up on the Winston. Dude, honestly, Great Britain is, I feel like, a much harder comp to run. Like, they're, the Winston just explodes. And he actually goes coming out on the Arisa. If you've been following Collegiate this week, this is something you're going to be incredibly familiar with. Yeah, and poor Bjorn's strategy coming through from Canada. That's Off really that interesting. Side. Jakaru gets poked early, so low. Gonna give some ult charge to Backbone, though, as long as they can stay relatively healthy. Canada opting to play it slow, also take an anti grenade. Well, we're seeing Good anti. to use that cool then also immortality field from crimson here early yeah, there's just gonna be so much more damage astro. coming out from canada Off now the inside angle took a bit too much damage onto the i mean known and lucio players gbr also, great britain aggressive taken out by couch car able to find noxious but it's just one kill and they already have two on the side of Canada and the objective. Yeah, this dive is just going to struggle. already have Nano coming up. Hole. You can't jump onto the Orisa. You can't jump onto the Torbjorn. Seeker's They're always just farming Nano right now. And making sure that W Maimon oh, isn't no. able to intrude into the backline and bait out that immortality field. Wait, that's, that's a so huge kill for Seeker. If he does get pressured by any form of folk coming from Kai, this is going to be a really tough nut for Great Britain to be able to crack, but it's probably going to come in the form of that Nano boost because with all of the damage they've taken from all of this poke, they've already got the ult up. I mean, Seeker's looking nasty as well so far on that Echo. Great Britain takes that top right angle. First all right, this the is their fight. This is the fight they've been looking for. Still available. Backbone uses. The grenade cooldown there on the inside angle. Unfortunately, doesn't connect with the Mano really has to the They go with the nano gauge on the echo. Mamo looking for Cal. Cal able to escape <laughs> with his life for now. As that nano runs away, Mamo goes so low. Has to go for oh, they're the using a lot of ults for this fight. Not Holy shit. A lot of value found just yet so far for the echo player of Great Britain. And now on the comeback, Cal comes with his own ultimate. False able to get the copy of Mamo gone. Also, here's the pylon to keep everybody safe. Something won the fight yet. The they have to do another. They have to commit another ult. Cal trades it back. He's getting some damage. Wow, if, they didn't, if Great Falls, Britain doesn't win this fight, they're in all that damage big trouble. And get instantly. Okay, they get point. They, so they burn five, the contest, four ults. Have control of this point now. Seeker though trades back Bunny Astro, so they take. I think Jakar built another primal, right? Now results in Backbone and Kai combining for two. There we go. Three falls able to trade back Jakar, but it might be too late. That took late. so long. Yeah, gorgeous power slide there from Kai to be able to break into that backline and finally dismantle Wait. the support so that the Urusa is no, they'll be fine. On out, Terra Surge is still in play. We'll play a little bit safe, so but they'll be fine. Molten Call. We may well see the combination. I really hope that we're going to get your sub numbers on a place i know Terra crap's gonna have to fix it he has control over all that not me <laughs> it's a little bit of a gamble, sub you have sub yeah. Yeah. Place. i know i know crap, crap will have to get it it would be insane if they did that noxious on the left side Again, they just take this cage control. Anti slows him down for now. Also, the rally is here from Funny Astro, but Backbone actually gets killed first. They come back for the peel, but now it's a terror surge Ooh. from False. Really a great off of him, and he actually lives until Wait, he drops the shield with one HP. And Canada get the flip at 76. Yeah, that terror surge, while it wasn't into the yeah. well, it did dismantle Great Britain's cap on the point. Like Wait, that's really bad, actually. We're not actually able to contest the cap coming out, so Canada flip it, and now Great Britain. They have Nano and Primal coming up, so they could probably win this fight. Yeah, yeah, this is winnable. Back again, giving a lot of space to Great Britain to set up on their die, but maybe just playing more towards the anti dive. Funny Astro also, by the yeah, way, they are playing more anti dive. To give them speed on that, on that, on that, on that Whoa, now the, Nano comes Nano, the Echo. Interesting. The too hard for not just to live wow. On the inside as well. Yeah, because the Nano Winston just doesn't do enough damage now, and plus he has Primal, don't even need it. That's smart. That's actually really smart. And also, it's going to cost him his life, probably. He actually does back up. Gets the shot Damn. on WMA. No way, Cal comes back for that angle. Also, he gets two. What the heck, Cal? I mean, they're not. They're gonna lose this. Wait, that's fight, but that was like three kills. Bad. At insane timings, Great Britain. Though, nah, actually, no, actually, no, it's not that bad. It'll be fine. 
absolutely terrifying. You can't Why does really so much fucking damage so though? Support, by the way. True. <laughs> Still have control of this point, going to have overclock, going to have duplicate, they've got the advantage. Wait, Seeker almost died. Charge. They just have to make sure yet again to shut the nano boosted Alright, this is literally gonna come down to whoever Crimson Nanos versus Kai's overclock. Wait, Kai needs to get this kill. Wait, Kai needs to get this kill. Wait, uh oh. Wait, he didn't get any kills. Uh, that overclock did not work. Didn't get any kills with it. That's unfortunate. This, I think this is our first look at Pro Play Bastion so far. World Cup. Meanwhile, Mamona actually has a bit of an off angle. There as well, so can keep pressuring out. You notice when they they're, they're saved, they sit there and hold their shift and just wait, and then the second they go for it, they all walk forward. But Great Britain just does decides just nope, not worth the fight. So even though they lose the point, but ooh, ooh. So they got the cap, but once the shift is out for Bastion, Bastion kind of is fucked. So they give them the point with the shift, but then they're like, yeah, you know what? Now that your shift's gone, we all in it. We just kill them. So they get 15%, but right Not you worth. have to bait the bastion transform you have to bait the accretion coming through from false you have to bait yeah. the immortality field and only then are you actually going to be able to go in and take a proper engagement so the fact that looks Great like Britain my copper lobby as quickly as they are is absolutely huge in terms of Canada not being able to use this that's fucking alive. copium holy shit walk in but immediate anti grenade comes through on the crimson nice immortality field usage but oh man by the bmw memo Finds those two kills, throws the grenades on Holy the Holy shit! Back, but Wait, he's rolling. Get another hold. Canada has to reset. This we haven't gotten to see much uh, of Jakaro's so POV on the Doom. I want to see more of it. Able to remove themselves and put themselves in a position where the Bastion's actually going to be able to get line of sight before W Maimon, Kai, Jakaro, even a funny Astro to an extent can just jump on them before they're ready to actually set Canada's up. Canada's not looking good here. They don't have any ults coming up. Great Britain's has ults coming up. They have the nano too, play. Allowing Backbone to get some easy anti grenades off. Also on the point, Jakaro goes low, so he gets the nano boosts. On the side of Backbone, Nade comes through as well into Canada, so they're slowing down, actually backing up entirely, and making sure. Yeah, it doesn't get really anything done fight. with the nano Coffee there, unfortunately. The was a bit low. On There's the not really line. much Jakaro can Here do on the tank there. As well to give them a bit of sustain. It's kind of just the rest of Canada, or the rest of Great Britain, kind of rolling. Through that rally of Canada's getting Seiko's some kills though now. Jakaro, so Great Canada needs to win this fight. Funny Astro able to find Noctis. After he's a bit safe, Seeker has to play until he gets a shift. With some ultimates on the point is sitting Canada, but they're going to take the is... don't to use any. Mamone's able to find Cal Kai. As well oh my as God. the Lamp of Crimson. However, Great Britain kind of playing slow. Do they opt to go for a fast engage on the false of the point? Looks for now, like it doesn't do. look like it. Rolling. I mean, Cal's missing. And because he got taken out now, he's going to be... he missed. He missed. He didn't get him. Wants to pull the trigger. Okay, but they got to kill, though. Clock. And Seeker, as a result, is forced to use probably, the artillery Probably reset no. that. I mean, that was both... Yeah. Yeah, to reset that. This maneuverability from Canada have to back up now. Great Britain. Who have some ultimates at least for next fight though. Yeah, Canada needed to push that aggressively. They needed to well. buy Cal that bubble of time also, to, to be able to start TikTok stream during. Uh, because Great Britain I'll just start are after this map. Both DPS ultimates for this fight. If you don't have that sustainability and you get baited into using immortality field, you're just done. Garu getting a ton of space towards that point. Overclock now pop for Kai. B drop to counter it. Connects on the false as well. The overclock surely will burn through. Seeker has no B, shift. False goes solo on the point. If they engaged right the then, they might have been okay. But they're also playing a little bit slow. Through. Onto that back line too. Crimson though still has okay, after Seeker's this shift, the they have to go. If copy. they don't go in right now, the car goes in. On the seeker, but oh, they but they windowed him and he exploded! Holy shit, he exploded! Nah, Crimson just did him so dirty! Poor guy. Wait. 
Mamone goes aggressive on to Seeker as well. Kai they get the Bastion? So through this damage, Holy shit, the they goals, actually win that. The point wait, they wait, they, they, wait, they have no ults. Cannon has no ults. They have an ultimate. They can essentially package, parcel it, put it onto W Maymoon, and leave it on Canada's doorstep. Forces onto the Diva Seeker. Can they touch? They have Nano. Yeah, Great I mean, Britain has they nano though. The touch off, but it is a bit messy, like you said. I think they're just gonna hold it and try to save somebody if they need to. Nana boost still available as well. Knocks or just down. go for that's the. Oh boy. The nana boost. I mean, that's a ton of damage. On from W Maymo, Nade comes through on a seeker as well, and yeah, it's nothing really else you could do here. Dude, that was so well Canada, played by Great Britain, actually. And get I thought after Jakaru died, that was gonna be GR. We'll take the first map of Ilios. Damn, that's a good first game! Holy shit! Thanks for Wait, oh, they're not running May Rush. Oh, they are running. Wait, wait, they're running Sigma May Rush. Oh, that's interesting. Wait, huge wall! Oh, but they broke it. I forgot what team plays like, they Canada. actually break the walls. Away Can't relate now. my ranked games. Immortality field out early. Oh, holy surprise. On to Astro. Moving on the corner. Kai. Big what kill by Kai. Kai. They he needed that. On the Next so wall. Thus far. They get a kill on the, onto the Sigma? Here. However, they do have the main advantage. They just easily walk on a Canada here. Yeah, Kai. they win that. Able to find Seeker as well. And on the Noxious. I mean, Great Britain, what a first Kai is for so scary. Back you have to be down. You have to be careful of him at all times. He's actually able to isolate one of the Canadian players on the stairs. That's why you saw the Immortality Field come out so early. And the second that it was out, Great Britain knew that they could pressure. Funny, Astro even getting yeah, in position to be able to not see Three for six months with my Samsung phone? phone? Yo, yeah, that's Bastion awesome. Rolls back on line means that Great Britain can just keep pushing, keep pressuring that front line, and now they've been able to cross corner. Ooh, Ooh they didn't break the wall for backbone. Back Wait, they backbone. broke backbone's wall, but they... Oh, but Great Britain didn't break it for God, backbone. That, Poor Britain guy. Down. So does Canada, though. I mean, Poor guy. Even though they got that kill, because they know Great Britain's probably got that ultimate advantage, right? Well, Crimson, however, does have amplification matrix before Great Britain. Yeah, so Windows is going to be huge here. Incredibly wary of considering. But Jakaro hits a big flux. I think they'll be fine. To be able to block the damage the second the window pops open. Let's go. Look at how far ahead Funny Astro is on ult. That window, but now here comes that big flux. Oh, well, yep, yeah, there it is. No immortality field to save. See, Didn't have immortality field flux. Wins that so easily. Great so far. On Great Royal flux. Royal as well. We know it's a long map, though. But Great Britain, I mean, this first objective, this first point, made them look amazing. Right, you want to know how? Emong is live under this one. I don't know who to Just watch. What do you want, dude? Cycling. I don't think either of us would be mad about supporting the other. So first amplification matrix pops open. Seeker's trying to use the transformation to actually be able to just chunk down the damage. Jakaro uses accretion to be able to knock the Bastion backwards. Doesn't cancel the transformation. However, does mean that he's not firing. Then goes for the Gravitic Flux, which means that the Bastion can't actually see through the window and can't melt anyone. And big, now, big oh, freeze. Can't and save both of them. Damn, they're gonna get they're they're gonna get my cap point off of this. Oh, big flux. Maybe not. Jakaro needs help. Jakaro needs help. They saved him. Beat and win and land. A very low amount of ultimates at the moment. After this shift, though, they're gonna get rolled. Also, after this shift, they walk into them, they kill them, right? Waiting for them to come. No, there's some spawn. I thought the cart got a little bit more pushed than that. Never mind. He's looking towards Noxious, who is making Maybe his not. return with that blizzard available. Great Britain, no, that's coming up. So they drop the overclock. Oh, Kai oh, going crazy, so dude. That comes through. A defensive Kai blizzard going crazy, out. dude. He's, he's so scary. Amazing I hate bumping into this dude in ranked. It's so fucking Nobody terrifying. I, mean, Kai I have been on the opposite side too many times. Seeker is also fucking scary. The 4K window bastion go burr. God damn. Like you said, it's a defensive blizzard coming through from Noxious. Kai with the Sojourn has some ability to be able to dodge it and then punish the players from Canada. Ashen go burr. Looking to be able to set up kills off of the back of it. But they're not Pretty able to take out there. Seeker. Now the artillery strike's going to come through, delaying Great Britain's push up onto this high ground, allowing force a little bit more time to build a big flux here. Flux Gets two. Try to keep Jakaru in check. Uh, not that big. The flux. Actually reacting to a Wait, Seeker gets one though. That May ultimate Seeker able to find I thought that well. Britain was going to win this w fight. Damn, so dude. This is such a hard point to take. Lost. 
team fight at the moment. Backbone's able to find Seeker, but, you know... Yeah, it wasn't a bad flux, but they still had all their resources, and then... We've cycled back, though. Dustin got a pick, so it's a little tough. Does not have Shocker things at three months. I still low-key think that when they were up here earlier, when they had Canada in the corner, they should have pushed them when it was 4v5. But they stayed cart because it didn't get that much progress. That's when Canada is going to start to sweat because you're in a lose lose situation. Oh, that's bad. They walk comes through, but does not save them from the Gravitic Flux. Immortality filled. Wait, their bash, their bash cut off. Alive there. A bit too much damage on the side of. They Canada. give it up. Now okay. They don't have any ultimates besides that window. Meanwhile, Great Britain have their own window. Um, that's actually very interesting. They gave that up. Understanding that Canada is just trying to play passive react to those ultimates accordingly but now they actually push in force that window out now counter window comes through wait Blizzard is here wait just through it just connect onto the grenade was that a bounce right click before the beat could even land from astro and now they're just up a member beats off pretty much useless yeah for the side great britain's in really bad trouble now actually holy shit wait for the baptists to come that was their ult fight which he is able to regroup however this is a bit of a slow the only way great britain wins this next fight is if if kai kills two if Kai kills two, there's a chance, but always been defensive favored as long as you can control this high ground and just pick apart the attacking team. Damn, dude, Seeker going crazy. That you can punish with the Sigma, unlike the Reinhardt, that shield is nowhere near as flexible in being able to cover all of those angles. You can hang it in one position and one position only, and that leaves everyone so so vulnerable if everyone's not on the same wavelength on when to rotate. Seeker unchained at the moment. I mean, so far he's looked amazing. Meanwhile, at the corner, False is holding. So a bit of a different approach to this fight as they drop the artillery strike. Takaru goes so low, so he comes back with his last shot. Takaru able to juggle around that shield. Now they push in with the wall, but it's into a blizzard now. Takaru gets frozen. His grandma tells to save him. It doesn't yeah. look like it. False able to get in the moan. Takaru also fell. 22 yeah, seconds left that's now. that's not I mean, good. Desperation hour now for Great Britain. Yeah, Kai used the overclock. Unless this is like a five-man flux. They're still going to lose players in that fight, and they have to I don't know about this one. I think this again, one might be GR. The exact same problem, only this time it's not just a bastion they're walking into. It's a flux and amp as well. There's the flux. Avoid the rock as well, so it doesn't get canceled. In touch. To back up from back up wow. Touches. Oh, my God. That Canada was such was a good hold by Canada right Stop there, actually. The the on the attacking side, great or Canada. Is, yeah, you're gonna, you're gonna, you're no, in like, a, you're trying to speed run a ban over there. Get at least one time here on this uh, first phase. Also, first thing is a bit more of a chance. Oh, that shield is just gonna melt. Seven hundred health in the face of a transform bastion is going to be. I wonder why Great Britain has decided not to run the bastion comps. No absent help for the poor. The immortality field couldn't even destroy. I mean, that was so quick. Backbone, nice Maywall. Also, the follow up there. That, well, if that YouTube's not working for you, chat, there's also needed. TikTok. Yeah, if you can hit with, you, you know, punish. the Bastion in terms of three up. is three up at the moment. limited as opposed to something like the Sergeant. Kai's going to be able to look for off angles. Oh, but if Seeker tries to go off in the side, yeah. he's immediately going to Damn. get absolutely extinguished. Got sniped. I was say, I mean, Backbone was such an aggressive off angle there. He would have fired that pick. Okay. I mean, Canada now minute off the They're not running Bastion because yeah, they have Britain, morals. Yeah, I don't think that's it. Go for that transformation. They have the corner to be able to hold back on to wait Double for the wheels to go away from the Do you want to win? I honestly right don't have a dog in this fight. This time, no, I like players on both teams. I like Jakaru. I like Seeker. I like Crimzo. Like I, I've I've bumped into them or played with them a bunch of times. So honestly, I would I don't mind either of them winning. Amazing work from Great Britain. Now they go aggressive with their own Baptiste window. Counterflank comes through from Canada, but it's really just such a small angle to work with there. Rock. The seeker does get the transform. Maybe hit by the rock there, but it's backbone again to find Dude, backbone's out. rolling. The bone of back doing so much right now. Also dropped the blizzard. The bone of back. True. I forgot on DPS. Not necessarily three kills for him directly there, but uh, Nayworm thinks it's too much. Amazing work. Cracks the prime. Yeah, and Canada, uh, they don't have the sign yeah, barrier yet. Because if I miss your guys' prime or anything, I do apologize. I don't mean to. A lot of it has just been immediate burst damage coming through from the backbone. And as a result, Cal with that slow burn heal up of the Lucio has not been able to retain ultimate charge in comparison to someone like Funny Astro, who's constantly keeping the team topped up from all of the poke coming through from the Bastion, Sigma, and May. Yeah, it's, it's underrated how hard that dynamic is to deal with as a Lucio player. Now the Gravity Clock comes through from Jakaru. Connects on the Noxious, forces that ice block to come through. Artillery strike Damn. forces the side of Great Britain to play a little bit slower. They avoid all the damage and backbone again. 
Crimson removed did not Dude, he's rolling. Oh, he's in trouble now, though. Nah, it's a good beat. They're fine. But then a may ult. But Jakaru's got shield up, so he's fine. Damn, Backbone's actually hard carrying. Holy shit. May is good right now. May is so good right now. AJ thinks it's a 2 1. And Grandma sees a 2 1. And then when the players of Great Britain fell, Noxious threw in the blizzard to try to keep those players stuffed up so that Twitch chat banned me for nothing, bro, crying. Face. I guarantee you that's not true. To be able to save everybody, and no yeah. one falls. I don't even know what happened, but I guarantee nobody gets banned in my chat for no reason. That is That never happens. And when it does happen, it's a mistake that gets rectified. Can be so hard to deal with. Oh, I'm just a massive fan of Brit Overwatch, and Great Britain's doing it incredibly phenomenally right now. Now, Canada has to walk through. Touch that payload, dropping the window. Wait, the window's the good, but it's well. it's it moving forward. Ooh, it's kind of so going the gonna opposite go way on the angle, Canada though. Wants a chance to take this first point. Doing a lot That's of a tough angle. At the moment, forces him to back up, but the heels are strong there from W Moon. Kai also dropped the overclock. Needs a little bit of a top up to make sure he doesn't die. It was a good overclock, kept him from going deep. Backbone, backbone gets another one. Able to find Cal on the Dude, Backbone might actually just hard carry this game. Canada. They don't even have false for a win. Either. And they don't have ultimates too. Six seconds Damn, left. Damn, dude. They didn't really touch this payload. Great Britain, they needed a fantastic point A. Backbone carry. Over Canada, Moxie. Today, Great Britain shutting down all of the haters. What a series. This is huge. Great That's an actual backbone diff.